I'm Storm Direct 8 Chief Meteorologist Ashley Brown. We're tracking rain tonight, but a nice warming trend in the forecast as well. Head into the Pacers game tonight. Take on the Lakers. Temperatures in the 40s throughout the evening hours. I think you'll definitely need uh, the umbrella throughout the night as we'll deal with these showers on and off. See, at first, I think most of the evening, these showers are pretty scattered, right? And then they become a little more widespread with some heavier downpours in the overnight hours. Most of us are sleeping at this time, but picking up on more in the way of rain. This rain kind of stays with us on and off throughout the day on your Wednesday, expecting wet weather. If you look at this future caps, forecasting model. You notice the colors of yellow and orange. Those are some heavier pockets of rain sliding through the area. As a result, I think flooding will be a concern for us going forward as we'll get in on the heaviest showers. I think really on a Thursday afternoon, Wednesday afternoon, and then on Thursday, just a few scattered showers sliding through once again. Also the possibility on some of some heavier downpour. So wet weather is on the way for us. That's why we have the flood watch that's out for our area. You can see Indianapolis into Bloomington and Columbus all included with the possibility of some flooding there, mainly for rivers and streams. So we'll watch out uh, for those heavier downpours that could bring some street flooding as well. Tomorrow's forecast. Well, most of the day tomorrow we'll spend it in the 50s, warming up nicely near 60 degree temperatures in the forecast. So, hey, we haven't said goodbye to warm weather, but there is a cold front on the way. We'll talk about that cold front in a second. First, we talk about the scattered showers that are available in the atmosphere that kind of sit over us on Thursday. Thursday night, as this system pulls out, I think some areas will get in on some flurries to some light snow as it moves out. Nothing will stick here. I think the bigger issue for you is what it feels like outside. So we go from the upper 50s on Wednesday and Thursday near 60 degrees, as you can see for Kokomo into Indianapolis, but areas in the 60s for Bloomington and Columbus. It will feel great. And then the cold front passes as the cold front moves through much colder air in place. Take a look at this from 59 to 28. Yes, the roller coaster ride continues for us as temperatures will remain pretty chilly for the weekend. Actually below normal once we get to Thursday and Friday, of course, the warm days and then next week, Monday and Tuesday, much cooler days. Chapman Hughes cooling eight day forecast as we get to Monday and Tuesday. We're in the low 40s, still above average. We're going to track the chance of a rain snow mix on Sunday and Monday. As you look at this forecast, a little bit of something for everyone here is we'll have some warmer days Wednesday and Thursday and some colder days Friday and Saturday. Now this forecast next week looks a little more typical as we'll see temperatures in the upper 30s to low 40s for much of next week.